Hello everyone and welcome to Irish Whip Pro Wrestling and boy do we have a main event for you. Here comes Chris Andrews, the Celtic Barbarian, the last CCE champion ever and he is making his ring awareness known tonight. If you don't know Chris Andrews, this man is from Ireland. He is possibly known as the fastest rising all star to game. This this man is so popular with the fans, and he doesn't even like them. That says something about Chris. He's a very cool guy to these people. Tonight, he has a hell of a contest coming in for him, as he faces another man who's been rising pretty quickly in car, Marcus Harold. These fans cheering for Chris, and Chris is just looking down on them, as if he's more superior. He's better than them. Physically, he is, but... I don't know about mentally. And here we are. The fans are getting their signs ready. And now they're on their feet. Here he is. Marcus Hero's music echoing throughout the arena. And so are his so is his name. These fans chant for him. This is electric. And here we are. Marcus Heraldry. Our RWU's Marcus Heraldry before he died at least. Marcus was having quite the match with Sin before he was attacked by the Saints of Apostasy. Not a good way to start in the business, but he's been making waves over on his YouTube channel. He's been uploading some matches that he's been having in various indie promotions. And now he's here in Irish Whip Pro Wrestling, his real break. One of the few non-Irish wrestlers on our roster. As you can see, wow! I think that's a Chris Andrews mock-up attire. It is. I can see the swords crossing. Well, that's... I don't think Chris is going to take too kindly to that. And here we go. These fans are ready. Marcus moving to the side. Well, Chris runs in. Here we go. And they're trading blows. And Chris... Here we go. Chris gaining control. Punching him on the ropes. Irish whips. Darts towards him. Ducks under. Runs over. Ducks under. Runs over, ducks under. Marcus catches himself, fakes him out. Marcus, oh. Irish whip, wait, pulls him back in. Side heck lock, take down, and goes for an anaconda vice. Nice. Pulling on the head and neck of Chris. Chris needs his uh, arm, too, which is also being wrenched to act, use his European uppercuts and clothesline. These two have very similar styles, so this is going to be a great one. And another Irish whip here. Ducks under. Ducks under. Another duck under. Ooh. And now he faked out Chris. Chris Andrews going out of the ring. Maybe a bit intimidated here. Egging on Marcus Heraldry. Marcus just pumped up. And Chris grabbing the leg. Pulls him over. And ooh, slams his neck into that rope. Front headlock here. European uppercut. European uppercut. And then this third European uppercut takes down Marcus. Goes for the pin. Not even a one count. Chris, side headlock, judo hip toss, another side headlock, and a judo hip toss, just tossing him over the shoulder, like I said, Chris has a lot of power, and that's one thing that's going to play in this match, and a snap near reversal, as Chris was going, ooh, into that knee, rolling out, these men are big, but they're agile, and they're fast, this is going to be a great match, and here we go, a knee by Marcus Heraldry, goes for a second time, but Chris, no, Swipes the leg away, fronts headlock again into a knee of his own, trying to corner Marcus, which is probably best because Marcus has an explosive style such as him. Chris Irish whipping him into that turnbuckle, runs off the ropes, and oof, Marcus Heraldry popping out of his daze rather quickly, tossing him into the mat, or winds up the arm. Heraldry charges in, oof, that's what I meant, an explosive clothesline into the corner right there. One, two... Chris kicks out, but his hands was on the ropes. The refs didn't even notice. Got a bad ref here, but he's been working all night. Snap mirror into a big boot. It stomps the stomach. And to another big boot. Marcus, wow, pumping up pretty eat quickly here. Kick out. Chris. Definitely. Ooh, chop to the neck. Chop to the stomach. Runs off the ropes. Chris runs in. Big slams his knee. Directly into the face. Heraldry. Snap mirror of his own into a big boot. 
Stomp's the- wait a minute. Wow! Look at Chris. Just mocking heraldry and just pumping himself up. This crowd is loving it, though. One, two, heraldry kicks out. Here we go, they're locking up. These men both have strength, but who's stronger? Chris Andrews. Chris Andrews did defeat Baron Bishop, the biggest member of Gen Y, and the, he had a, quite the undefeated streak. Now, throwing some lefts here. Heraldry unable to really fire at Chris. Nice punch to the head. Chris stomps him to the ground and goes for a pin. Like I said, Chris is a ground and pound type of guy. He does not go technical. He can be technical, but it's not his strong suit. Oof. Right, right when he's going for that European. Lefts. Lefts into the corner. Heraldry backs up. Oof. Nice punch. Punch. Backs up a little bit. Chops him in the face. And Chris having enough now. Winding up the arm. Runs off the ropes. Marcus Heraldry pops up with another explosive clothesline. What did I tell you about this kid? Explosive. Just like Chris. And that's why Chris is in for it tonight. Here we go. Just... Trying to find out where he wants to throw him. Center of the ring. Body slam. Bounces off the rope. Doom drives the leg into the neck. Bounces off the rope into a jumping knee. Rolls out of it. Runs over to Chris for the pin. One, two. Chris kicks out. Six minutes into this thing, and I'm already, I'm already hyped. And here we go. A pull back into the elbow. Chris egging him on. Uh, here we go. Chris side headlock. Oof. Elbows him in the t on the top of the head. Right there. Oof. Twist the arm. Snap mirror. Elbow to the back of the head in the upper neck area. That's gotta hurt. Oof. Kick him in the face. Showing no respect to Marcus Heraldry. Which is... This is vintage Chris. He doesn't usually show respect for his opponents. But this kid, Marcus, you gotta watch out for him, Chris. You just can't be cocky. Winds up the arm. Runs in with an explosive clothesline of his own. Like I said, these men have similar styles. I may sound like a broken record here. So don't be so too surprised here. And Chris runs in. Discus Lariat. Taking down Marcus. He's kind of glaring at him before he goes for the pin. Two kick out by Heraldry. Chris front. Side headlock. Wrenching onto it. Before a... Oof! Just tossing Heraldry like he's nothing. One, two, kicks out Heraldry like I... Oh, God. That looked ugly. Here we go. And he's going to do it again. Chris really testing the heart of this kid, egging him to get up. These two have never met in ring before, to my knowledge, and they're already entertaining. And a nice kick to the gut by Chris. And here we go. Atomic drop. Iris whips Chris to the other side of the ring. Runs in. Ooh, me. And Iris whips him. To the other side of the ring, runs it. Ooh, a jumping knee, dropping Chris to his knees. Chris completely dazed, and Marcus pumping up this crowd. Gonna turn him over, lift the leg. One, two, kick out. And that's just gonna be. That's gotta weigh in on the mind of Chris. Oof, body slam. Here we go, corkscrew elbow, shifting his body midair. Just so he can catch the chest with more speed and impact. Very smart by Heraldry. Like I said, these men can be technical. And here we go. Snap mirror. Has the knee into the back. Kind of pulling on it. Pulling on the neck. The back of the head. And oof. Chris trying to get up. Oof. Before he can even move. Just ramming his knee. Into the back. Pulling on the arms. Here we go. Another hold. Here. And he's just yanking and yanking on the arms. And Marcus in full control of this match. Ooh, kick to the stomach. Kick, uh, Chris catches the arm. Spins him out. Ooh, quickly. German suplex bridges it. One, two. Heraldry kicks out. Like I said, Chris. Uh oh Spine buster. Wow. One, two. Chris going for the quick win here. Trying to do everything he can to take out Heraldry. Oof. Bridging back suplex. One, two. Chris is very athletic. I mean, bridges are something we see Chris do, but not very frequently. And Heraldry having enough the quick pin attempts. And he tosses him into that turnbuckle. Picks him up. Heraldry with a bridging suplex of his own. One, two, kick out right there. Heraldry kick to the stomach. And oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm a bit dizzy after that one. One, two, Chris Andrews. Whoa. One, 
two. And oh wow, this this has been great. Uh oh, wait a minute. Twist the arm. Judgment slam by Chris Andrews. Out of nowhere. And uh oh. Chris having enough of this kid. Well, goodbye, Marcus Heraldry. Thanks for coming. It's over for you. I think he's going for that bicycle kick. The Danax. No! Wow! Heraldry catching a midway. Iris whips him to the apron, runs in. Oh, oh nice left right there. What's, what's he doing? Picks up Chris. Oof! Matt, damn, this back just smacking against the apron. Heraldry wrenching at the arm. Now gonna Iris whip him. Oof! Back first into that. Back. Oh my god! Just relentless assault. Like I said, two smash mouth, ground and pound, in your face type of styles. And Heraldry showing he can fight just as hard as Chris. Nice elbow to the nose. Oh, gonna wake Chris up. Chris stumbling to his feet a bit. Doesn't quite know where he is. Uh oh, pushes Chris into a oof. I said Chris still a bit dazed from that elbow to the face or maybe that knee. Marcus is just very impactful. This kid. Pumping up this crowd, one, two, and a kick out. You gotta believe, had he not kicked out there, Heraldry had this one. He probably should never taunt it to the crowd. Oof, Chris was out of it, but now he's back in it. Gonna back up, oof, damn! Damn, they took that man's head off, in this ring. And uh oh, no, 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 he's not even, oh, wrist lock, Larry. Lord, Chris Andrews pulls no punches. This man is in here. When he gets in that ring, his sights are taking you out. And oh, oof! Jumping clothesline from the top rope, turning Heraldry out, goes for the pin. One, two, Marcus. Marcus showing heart. I would have been done after that one. Then again, I have a very scrawny, skinny body. Here we go. Heraldry firing away at Chris nonstop. Just keeping on Chris. Uh oh. Iris whips him. Chris goes for the clothesline again, ducks. Heraldry psychs him out. Big clothesline of his own. Picks him up. Iris whips him into the corner, winding up that arm. Heraldry runs in with another explosive clothesline into the corner. Chris's neck bouncing off that top turnbuckle. Heraldry whips him into the ropes. Off the rope and a jumping clothesline. Chris, oh my god. Heraldry showing he's just as good as Chris when it comes to using his arms. Jumps off the top. Oof. Taking Chris down. Heraldry on fire. But kid, stop taunting. You have him down. Go for it. Oof. Chris. Kicking out. You got to think if Heraldry beats Chris. Uh oh, well, quick roll up. One. Two. Whoa. Heraldry kicks out. And kick again. Another quick roll up. One, two, kick out. Whoa, -oh. wait, Marcus rolling into a pin of his own. Chris is out, can kick out. And Chris kicks out. Got it, like I said, if Heraldry wins this, he can he can be in line for I uh oh, wait a minute. Elf! Ain't wrestling Harold slam right there. Chris Andrews dragging him into that corner. Oh no. Here we go. Setting up for another day next. This is over. You fought long and hard, kid, but you're not gonna win this one. Chris charging in. Double leg sword out of nowhere. And Chris is out. That's it. That's all she wrote. Two. One. No way. There is no way. Chris. That's it. That, that Chris just made me a believer. Chris Andrews gets kicked out of a move. No one in the wrestling industry today has kicked out of the double edged sword. I, I, I can't believe it. And now Chris on the assault here. Now he's showing his frustration. Now he he knows to let he's not he cannot just be disrespectful with this kid. He's got a oh my wow double edged sword to Marcus and that's got to be it. And oh well of course Harold would kick out of his own move. I mean oof. I think Marcus is having enough of the disrespect by Chris Andrews. I'm telling you, Chris. He just can't play around with this kid. This kid is the real deal. And oh, just firing away at Chris Andrews, taking him down. Now he's gonna continue the, the pounding of Chris. Marcus Heraldry showing the frustration, showing he's tired of Chris disrespecting him. Throws him into that corner. And here we go. Oof. Left, right, left, right. Here we go. 
Heraldry, oh my god! Taking him down. Oof. That's not it. Heraldry twisting him back, tosses him back into that corner, and here we go. More punches. Marcus is livid. Tired of the disrespect now. And it pumped up the crowd again. What is he doing here? Uh -oh. A kneel. Uh oh. Oof. A kneeling version of the double edged sword. That's got to be it. One, two. Chris kicking out. Somehow. I don't know. What is Chris made of? He, he can't be of this race. He cannot be human. Aerodry has him top rope bound. Uh oh. He's pumping up this crowd. He's going for something big. Wait, Chris back to his feet on the top rope. No! Oh, giant clothesline rendering heraldry unstable to kick out just incapacitating him with that big clothesline from the top and the irish will whip him off the top oh pulls him in for another clothesline here we go chris chris known for the clotheslines Oof. known for the brutal move set winding up that arm you know what's next he usually twists the arm and goes for another wait a minute guess not Chris winding up that arm again. Go, uh oh. He bounces off the ropes. Get a running start. And clotheslines Heraldry right out of the ring. And this crowd is just loving this match so far. You can see the excitement all over his face. All over Chris. All over these fans. And, whoa! Jumps over Heraldry. Just misses the clothesline. Big knee to the face. Similar movesets. Oh! A discus lobby. You can see it in these men's faces as. They keep trading moves. Drags them. And Heraldry slowly picking up Chris. It's got to be hard to drag someone of Chris's size and weight. Leans him on our table. Bounces Chris's head off our prop here. Oh! Knocking him down. And oh, come on, Heraldry. You just knocked over my drink, man. I have a lot of respect for you, but what are you doing? Tossing Chris. Oof. What? What is he doing here? Oof. Hitting Chris and Heraldry. Walking over to the steps. Oh no. No, 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 no. He he's thinking about it. And Chris. Oh my god, Chris running out. Oh! That's it. Heraldry's done. That's it. He just threw himself through a table. Chris dragging the heavy body the heavy dead weight and he tosses heraldry into the wind chris hurry up this kid is dead he's done and oh near how did heraldry kick out these men have got to be made of something i just no one no one just throws themselves through a table and get up and now they're trading shots this this is getting uh oh this is uh Chris. Chris with shots of his own. Heraldry. The here we go. The flurry of fist. Chris. Oh my God. Just takes him out. Chris off the ropes. No. Whoa. 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 I can't. I'm dizzy. One. Two. Yeah, Chris barely kicking out. Double edged sword at point blank range. That's gotta be Aussie rope. One. Two. Three. My God, what a main event for Irish Pro Wrestling here. Irish Rip Pro Wrestling, my bad, folks. And these fans are on their feet. They're cheering for Heraldry. Now, let's take a look at this beautiful match. Here we go. Chris spins him out into that Wrestling Herald Slam. Now, Chris, right here, he's setting up for a day next. Heraldry, out of nowhere, with a double-edged sword. That a next one had to think it was over. This has to put Marcus in contention for the Irish Whip Pro Wrestling title. Then he's, that, that, I don't know how Marcus even survived that that, that, that class. I don't know how, like, I'm still shocked to this very moment. Chris. Boom, trying to take his head off again, but Marcus able to duck it. And then this match is beautiful, folks. This is what you're going to get here when you watch Irish with pro wrestling. Nothing but intense, brutal, fun matches. i got to say I've enjoyed myself tonight. Devontae Ward is signing out. No way of a minute. And Marcus is celebrating. Popping up the car. What's that? Crap. Wow. And even after he loses, he doesn't show respect. He comes in and he smacks him in the chair. This is disrespectful. 
And Chris, do wow, he's walking off. Wow, Chris, how disrespectful of you to hit this man after he gave you a run for your money and now look at Chris.